In this week's edition of A Ray of Hope, the story of an, of an amputee who hasn't allowed his circumstances to hinder his aspiration of being independent. With that story, here's Kian Morgan. For 65-year-old George Heron, determination can bring you to new heights, like atop a roof with one leg doing masonry. It's a craft he has now mastered after losing his leg over 30 years ago. I was an accident on Spanish Town Road, 91, and then from there, 92, just to have a baby born, and I said, I have to find something else to do. But first, he had to practice. We just walk around and watch what the men them doing because I didn't know it before or anything. And we start go around and one day I go look on a foundation, how them line it out and so forth. Confident he could manage this line of work, he made an attempt. My sister did have a, a house and she didn't want her friends to do it. I tell her we would do it and I start from there. And with her job well done, he got contracted to do others, completing sizable tasks promptly. I do a complete addition other day. Someone else did block it up and put it on the top, and me and the next apprentice mason, and we take like four weeks for rough cast granite. Put in flooring, plumbing work. Some jobs even solo. On this pathway, I build about uh, four or five of them. I have upstairs down there. Me alone actually build it. Carry cement them all upon my head, go upstairs. Some half a column. Me alone dig that foundation. And he does it with pride. I always got work. I try to do my work properly. Try to be honest with people. For him, encouragement goes a long way. A lot of people, them see me do the work, rate me and give me respect. It is why Mr. Heron says he'll never stop working. Doctor, I even say I must take a, a two week. When I take two, three, four days, it's like me have to go back out. Because all, all my body set up with the work, I can't sit down. Because I feel like when I'm not working, I'm feeling sick. With a ray of hope, I am Ken Morgan.